Introduction Destiny is something that is to happen or has happened to a particular person or thing. In addition, destiny can be potentially characterized as the unknown and inevitable future or a predefined condition and life path. Someone can think that destiny is unavoidable that has to happen, but, to my mind, people can totally control and oversee what they do. In this essay, it is essential to demonstrate that destiny is the result of people's personal actions and particular decisions and that individuals choose their destinies. Destiny as the result of people's actions As an example, that depicts the situation in which people choose their own destiny in life, it is feasible to emphasize the writing Iliad by Homer. Concerning the poem's plot, in this ancient Greek epic text, the main character Paris changes his destiny. In fact, he was a prince that could select a peaceful way of life, nevertheless, he subsequently decided to abolish this option. To justify this statement, Paris was considered Menelaus's guest, but he chose to rob Menelaus' wife and completely transform his life. As a consequence, he decided to get romantically involved with Helena and start the Trojan War. Thus, it is clear that Paris is own of his actions since he had to recognize and logically comprehend what will be the probable repercussions of being in a romantic relationship with Helena. In Odyssey, which is a poem by Homer, Odysseus' destiny is to return home after a long voyage. The fates are not present in the story, instead relying on the gods will to bring things to pass for Odysseus. The deity Poseidon, who is furious with Odysseus for blinding his child, prevents the possibility of Odysseus' peaceful return home. In general, his destiny appears to be well known among the minor gods. Zeus confesses that it is his wish for Odysseus to arrive at Ithaca unharmed but without his companions. Another instance where destiny is to be chosen is in the Hebrew Bible, the history of Joseph. This specific religious perspective of destiny is related to the notion that the Almighty God's sovereign will is of particular significance, but that man's personal decision also has a position. Individuals must make the appropriate judgments and choices in order to fulfill their fate. In Dante's Inferno, destiny plays a prominent role in determining the message that each sinner teaches Dante. In my opinion, the prospect of facing a gruesome penalty for a seemingly small transgression is alarming to contemporary readers. Dante's Inferno places a strong emphasis on free will, to the point that Dante feels the sinners in hell choose their destiny. The Mahabharata's central topic is the concept of solemn duty and fate. Every figure in writing is placed into a certain social circle or social position that is bound by holy law to do the duties assigned to it. Characters who fulfill their religious obligations and predetermined destiny are praised, whereas characters that do not are condemned. Conclusion in conclusion, an individual's or thing's destiny is something that will or has occurred to them. Furthermore, destiny can be described as either an unknown and unavoidable future or a predetermined circumstance and life direction. Examining the explanations and interpretations of destiny in several writings, including Iliad, Odyssey, Hebrew Bible, Inferno, and Mahabharata, it is possible to state that the meaning of destiny varies substantially. In some cases, a person can potentially define his life path by his decisions, whereas, in others, characters will be punished for their initiative in order to influence their destiny. StudyCorgi.com has everything you need for successful studies. Writing tools, informative articles, and essay samples. Come check it out!